Warning, the following video contains some major video game spoilers as this is part one of the best video game easter eggs of 2017. In Ubisoft's For Honor, set up a custom match and set the game mode to a duel. While under the map selection though, highlight the Sanctuary Bridge and make sure it is set to night. It is then during multiple rounds you'll be able to spot a bridge in the distance with two warriors that represent Hornbuckle and Blades from Pit 2 in the Mortal Kombat Round series. Three. gonna do about it you know what might look better on your nose what the bar incredibly it is now just over 22 years since the release of LucasArts graphic adventure full throttle but it has taken 22 years for this particular Easter egg to be discovered as it was only last month that Double Fine Productions unveiled the remastered version of the classic that also included audio commentary and it was then I received this message. Cool. And yeah, with that, I took to the floor safe and finally after punching in way too many combinations, I discovered Mark Crowley's birthday and the long lost Easter egg. <coughs> 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 It was in 1951 that a movie named Distant Drums recorded the sound of a man screaming. Ah! That was later named the Wilhelm Scream, after Private Wilhelm from the film The Charge at Feather River. It's a sound effect that has been used hundreds of times across movies, TV shows and even video games. And the latest addition to the list can be found in Horizon Zero Dawn. After activating the first Sheikah Tower upon the Great Plateau in Zelda Breath of the Wild, the old man will point Link in the direction of the first shrine and the first of four trials across the initial segment. It is during these trials you'll be able to pick up four runes and the necessary abilities for conquering puzzles along the way. But if you study each of the four hand gestures by the first four monks, and you will actually be able to see that they are signalling the Triforce symbol. Death Stranding is an upcoming action open world video game and is developed by Kojima Productions. It is also being designed using the Decima engine created by Guerrilla Games, 
who are the developers of Horizon Zero Dawn, which is definitely one of the best games I've played this year. Anyway, throughout Horizon you can discover three separate items that feature at some point across the two trailers of Death Stranding, such as by taking on the quest The Heart of the Nora, Aloy can find the stranded figure. Then amongst the Zero Dawn project facility during Deep Secrets of the Earth, the stranded shackles worn by Norman Reedus are perched on a lab table. And the third item, the Stranded Necklace, is located within the Grave Horde. After collecting each of them, you can trade them in for a mysterious box from a merchant in Meridian. You can see that each item is represented by Kojima Productions' new logo, and you will receive several boxes and a pair of socks. After the prologue and progressing through the factory in Nier Automata, the segment of the bunker will begin, and for reasons I will not spoil, 9S will help 2B to calibrate her settings which is filled with many mini easter eggs by responding to the following questions in numerous ways. Plus, there's possibly a rather lewd scene right at the end, but I'll leave that up to your imagination. Are you there? Can you hear me? Uh, hello? Go ahead and adjust your settings so you can hear me, alright? Uh, adjust the settings until you can hear my voice. Uh, could you try and pick up the pace a little bit? This is getting embarrassing. Alright, are we good now? Oh, uh, thank you. Anyway, that takes care of the settings. Uh, hold on. Your self-destruct permissions are missing. Wait a sec, we need to restore those. I could set it for you, but you should probably do it yourself. Regulations and all, you know? Huh? Wait, no. You need to leave that turned on. Yeah, you can't really do that. It needs to be turned on, except in very specific cases. I'm afraid I can't leave this as is, ma'am. Please give your permission. Hey, come on now. I'm just trying to follow regulations here. Okay, good. 
If things go wrong during an op, you may have to sacrifice yourself in order to finish it, so... Once you're finished making adjustments, you can go ahead and close this out. I know no one likes the idea of self-destructing, but that's what regulations call for. Still, I'll keep it a secret from the commander. Oh, I see you've turned vibration detection on. Let's run a check to make sure it's working. I'm gonna tap you on the shoulders, all right? How was that? Did you feel it? Huh? That's odd. Everything should be set up correctly. Here, let me try somewhere else. I'm gonna tap you on the arm this time, okay? Did you feel that? Huh? Really? Well, if you say so. How about this? Uh, how was that? Are you serious? You didn't feel anything just now? Well then, let's try something else. Well? Hmm. I don't know what's causing this, so we'll need to run some precision diagnostics later. Regardless, that's the end of the check for now. So I really hoped you enjoyed the video and don't forget you can always follow the channel on Instagram, Facebook and Twitter and if you haven't quite had enough of me for today then here are several videos to watch which are all available on mobile devices.